Zishoma ne zishoma. Slowly and slowly. Zimbabwe irugusumuka. Zimbabwe is rising. <laughs> A lot of things are happening in Zimbabwe but people don't know. In this year of 2023, a lot of things are happening since it is a year of elections. Scandals, quarrels are happening and also prophecies are provided for the elections. In this video I'm going to show you three prophecies by different prophets that you need to know and write them down for confirmation. Let's get into the video, as we all see, the prophecies are given so let's wait for the elections and confirm whether this these the prophecies will come true or not. The 2023 election if it is going to be permitted. Now listen with three ears. The Lord spoke to me and said, go and tell Zimbabweans that I want them to give me what is called a steering wheel for me to drive that steering into my wheel, to turn that steering into my wheel, uh, into my wheel. And he said, let them give me a horse to ride. And I said, what does that mean, O oh God? And God said, it's the votes. Then I started seeing angels in ballot box in those, what do you call those places where you go when you are voting inside? The, the, the polling station inside there, I don't know, that cubicle. Uh, the cubicle where you are. So I saw angels that were there, and when people were voting, it was like there was a cloud coming upon them. And then God said, go and tell all Zimbabweans from each and every province that in 2022, once they hear that voting registration has started, every Zimbabwean must go and register to vote because the Lord was saying, their vote is going to be my horse, which I will use to get into my will. I will ride that horse into my will. So I said, what is your will? And God said, I will not tell you. But I, the main statement, listen, was God just said, I want every Zimbabwean to register. If they don't do that, they will not have given me a horse. I want a horse to ride. I want a horse to ride. I want a steering. And it is the vote of the Zimbabwean people. Hi. Of the nation of Zimbabwe, concerning what I saw in the upcoming elections, I begin to see something which was very strange. But I want people to know something so that people, they cannot quote me wrong. Because in a vision, I saw first a baobao tree, which was very big, very big and very old. And also second, I saw a wind. But when I saw the wind, I saw the wind blowing, and the wind was blowing, blowing blowing and when the wind was blowing it was taking everything which was surrounding everything in the bush but when i saw the wind when it comes on a baobao tree the baobao tree it was been moved to the extent that people they begin to think that yeah now the baobao tree has been falling now but when i saw people when they were celebrating that this is the end of the baobao tree i begin to look deep in the spirit then i saw the roots of the baobao tree were so deep to the extent that i saw the tree was moved by the wind and people they begin to celebrate that now that the baobao tree has been removed but later on, I saw because the roots were so deep in the ground. I saw the old baobab tree came back to life and it stayed again. And I asked the Lord, what is the meaning of this? And the Lord said, it is not yet time for the baobab tree to be uprooted. That's what I just heard from the Lord.
Satana achida achida o asngada asngada. Whether the devil likes it or not. Tirukufamba matsimba ichiporofita. We are walking in the steps of the prophetic. Ende kuvakuseni kushikama neri ne pakati pe usiku. From the morning till evening. Tikaona varipo pa utunga miriri vachi pusha shataka ratizwa na mwari. If we are seeing the current leadership pushing what God is doing. No support akushikayo ashot kwa over warutsa. We we'll support it to the end, no matter 